wish your backpack was dripping. What's on your face? From my backpack? On my face? Nah, it must have been that Kool-Aid I had earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I saw Marvin today. He was acting really strange. And it looked like he had blood on his mouth or something. And then I saw that poster of that missing pregnant girl on campus. It was really weird. a poet during what is referred to as the Harlem Renaissance and even though this was, it was called the Harlem Renaissance it was really you know a movement that was taking place all over America it was in Chicago and New York and um, at all uh, cities all across America uh, but Langston Hughes really tried to through his poetry he tried to embrace the common African-American man which was uh, a really progressive movement for that time period I was in class today and Kurt and Marvin were acting really weird and it looked like they had blood on their faces and I seemed to be the only one that cared. It's really weird. I don't know what's even going on. Listen, you really need to calm down. I'm going to tell you something that I really hope you can handle. Do you think you're ready to hear it? I think so, yeah. Okay. At, every year at the end of October, a group of friends, like guys, they impregnate and kill the baby and the mom and they put the baby in a baby closet and let it starve so they can eat it. No way. Way. And they eat the mothers too. Meet my friend tonight and she'll show you. Okay, what does she look like? She'll be wearing a striped sweater and she has brown hair. Quiet, or they're gonna come kill you too. 